I do ultrasound basically because I like meeting new people and creating a better experience by them coming to see me. Ultrasound uses high frequency sound waves which we can't hear. A handheld device called a transducer is placed on the organ or the area that we're interested in. The transducer transmits sound beam into the, the body and then we get echoes back from the body and from the tissues and they are transmitted to the screen so that we get a, a real-time image. Ultrasound is safe, it just uses the high frequency sound waves but it's completely safe modality. What happens is you'll come in and I'll ask for a history of what the trouble's been and I'll get you to show me where you've been sore or what the problem's been, what kind of length of time it's been happening. Then I'll get you to lie up on the table or sit in the chair depending on what area we're looking at and we'll be applying some gel to that area so that um, I can get an image of with the transducer. I need the gel to get rid of the air interface between the transducer and in your skin just because the ultrasound doesn't transmit well through air. And and we'll just be applying a little bit of transducer pressure in order to get the images that we require. The preparation for an ultrasound varies depending on what part of the body we're looking at. If we're looking at a thyroid or a breast or a shoulder, there wouldn't be any preparation for that. But if we're looking at an abdomen or the, a pelvic ultrasound, you may have to fast or drink some water and have a full bladder. You may have to get changed and wear a gown just so that the area that we're assessing is bare. We need to get to the skin to be able to transmit the ultrasound beam, but we minimally try and change the patient. When you book in for your ultrasound, the receptionist will let you know exactly what preparation you are required to have. Typically you can bring one person in as a support person. We have to remember that ultrasound is an important diagnostic tool and as such I need to be able to concentrate quite heavily. If you bring a lot of people in with you or small children I tend to get distracted and you might have a suboptimal assessment of the area that we're looking at and I want to do the best test possible for you. You're not allowed to film during the ultrasound. A set of images you'll be able to take with you representing what we've seen today. I can't provide immediate feedback as to what I have found that is wrong. After the scan, my specialist radiologist will make a written report for your doctor. They will then be faxed or emailed to your doctor. You can expect a result in the next day or the day after. What I'll get you to do is just talk to the reception staff on the way out and they'll be able to tell you exactly when the report will get to the doctor and then you can go back to your referring doctor to get the results.